Right now, Utica College students and those who wish to enroll there next year are breathing a financial sigh of relief, and they should be. Beginning next year, the students there will pay 42% less in tuition than they're paying this year. The private college is lowering the tuition from $33,946 to $19,996. Jennifer Lukey takes a look now at how this college can do that and why it may not work with some struggling colleges here in the Capital Region. Every student you talk to here on campus thinks this is the best idea they've heard in a long time. The tuition reset starts in 2016. I've posted it on Facebook and Twitter and everyone's already, you know, excited for me and um, everyone thinks it's a great thing just at its initial face value. We were excited that they're thinking about it from a student perspective and trying to help make things easier because education is so important. The college has spent the last two years planning for this decrease, visiting schools that have tried it to see what works and what doesn't. We will drop tuition, but we will also proportionally drop student aid. That allows federal and state dollars and outside loans and endowed scholarships from us to go much further toward meeting that need. It'll cost UC in the first year, but they've planned for that. Instead of buying a transformer next year or paving some more sidewalks, we're going to use $2 million to invest in our students and our families. And we're guaranteeing every student savings. Can this model work, do you think, at other colleges here in New York. I'm absolutely convinced it can and we hope it will. But not all schools would be able to pull it off. They have to have diversified revenue coming in. They should have strong enrollment already. They shouldn't rush it. It takes two years to truly plan for this. The schools that rush it fail. And schools that are already in the red, like a few in the capital region, don't have cash on hand to cover the first few years of losses. Either way, UC says anyone interested in what they're doing here is welcome to ask questions. We will be evangelical about this. Open up our books, uh, help other schools with this model. The president tells me there still may be some small increases to tuition over the next decade, but it would take 15 to 17 years of those increases to get back to what students are paying today for tuition. At Utica College, Jennifer Lukey, CBS 6 News. We want to give you a little perspective here. Moody's Analytics reports that the amount of outstanding student loans has skyrocketed 76% to almost $1.2 trillion since 2009 as the college costs have shot up.